Hi there, it's James from Twinkle and welcome back to another video. In this video we're going to be looking at how to use the loop cards available on the Twinkle website. The games are typically played by a teacher handing out a card to every pupil in the class. Each pupil has a question and an answer on their loop card. However, these obviously do not match and therefore they need to find the card with their answers and the other card with their question that matches. Just like you can see in this example here. Once everyone has found their question and answers, the card should form a complete loop. If this is not the case, the children need to find where they've gone wrong. These loop card games can be a great way to test a child's knowledge of different topics, as well as testing everybody's problem solving and teamwork skills. Here we have the Key Stage 2 Space Loop Cards. These are perfect for the whole class to use towards the end of the topic. Another way of using loop cards like these would be to use them at the start of a research lesson. In pairs the children have to complete the loop. However, most of the knowledge is unknown to them. Therefore, when they come up with a question that they're not sure of the answer to, they have to research that particular area before they can complete the loop. This of course could be turned into a competitive race between the class to see which pair can complete the loop first. These Olympic flag loop cards are a great way for children to learn the flags of the world whilst also playing a fun game. Once the loop has been completed, the cards can be used for the children to learn about the geographical location of the country they have on their card. They could also research the traditions the country has, as well as the most successful Olympian that's come from the country. There are so many creative ways to use loop cards, so why not check out one of our other loop card explainer videos. So I hope this video has helped inspire you to use loop cards, whether you're in the classroom or at home. Thanks for watching and I'll see you again.